begin with the Target 12 investigators exclusive pay delay. An employee with autism reports to work three days a week for about a year, but never gets paid. And tonight we're getting results. And we're now told the checks in the mail for the Portsmouth man, but we wanted to know why it took months for this to happen. Target 12 investigator Walt Buto with the details you'll see only on 12. A number of statements and documents reviewed by Target 12 indicate this Portsmouth 21 year old was a productive worker. In August of 2014, Caleb Dill was placed as a prep cook at the Middletown Applebee's by the state-funded agency Resources for Human Development. We were told by RHD that they were going to hire him and he was going to get paid. RHD sent a work coach with Caleb to the restaurant and documented that Dill was a tireless worker. One young man told me that they were lucky to have him. That, that Caleb just continues to work and work and he won't stop or take a break until the very end of his shift. His parents say they signed him up for direct deposit, but the checks never came. When you have something Bob Dill tells Target 12 he asked RHD about it several times, but after months of working four hour shifts, about three days a week, still no check. He was enjoying the job, so we really weren't focused on the income so much. But after that amount of time, you kind of wonder what's going on. While Dill says he told RHD about the problem several times, a regional director of operations for the restaurant chain tells Target 12 this. RHD never contacted us. The first we heard of this was when you, as in Target 12, called. We obviously feel terrible. We have to make this right. RHD receives funding from the Department of Behavioral Health Care, Developmental Disabilities and Hospitals. A spokeswoman for that state agency tells us if Caleb Dill was not getting paid, RHD should have contacted the state. But she says there are no records that anyone from RHD did that. Target 12 reached out to RHD several times over the past few weeks, including again today. But we were told confidentiality regulations restrict any comment about Caleb Dill's case. Yes. Applebee's tells us they are paying Caleb Dill for 166 hours of work. The Dills tell us they're trying to figure out if that covers the amount of time their son worked for the restaurant. With the Target 12 investigators, Walt Buto, Eyewitness News.